when the boy came, he was told that my husband was no more. So he left us with the clothes and went back to tell his master the bad news. The master told him to come back and collect the money. Hey, which money? I lost it on him. I'm like, okay, fine, you are in luck. We've not buried him. He's still at the mortuary at St. Teresa. Go there. Good morning, guys. So this woman lost her husband and a few days into his demise, his dry cleaner sent his boy to deliver his clothes to they had to demand then they broke the sad news to him but the story is that the dry cleaner insisted on getting paid for his services first thing i want to say is um i want to do is to sympathize with the woman i understand it hurts so much i've lost a loved one before and i don't even want to experience it or wish it for my worst enemy but the, why am i making this video my question here is so she expects the man i understand the part of the man being so insensitive at that point but i think as an adult we sometimes have to be logical than emotional on a daily people lose their lives from complications of medical procedures some even lose their lives in the process they don't make it out yet the hospital will seize their body and ensure the family pays the full bill before the body of the deceased will be released to the owners which before now i would consider to be insensitive but there are some facts about life we just have to accept as it is i've also seen people selling things to clear the debt that their loved ones incurred while they were still alive i've also heard about people borrowing money taking loans just to bury their diseased loved ones so would you say or expect the people you borrowed money from not to take it back because you used it for funeral i perfectly understand this insensitive for the man to insist on getting paid for a service he rendered to her late husband but my question is was she supposed to unleash her anger on this man i even feel somehow that she picked up her camera just to talk about this anyways let me know your thoughts in the comment section subscribe to my channel share this video and let me know your thoughts in the comments so a few days after my husband died his dry cleaner sent his boy to the house to deliver the clothes that my husband gave him to wash before he died when the boy came he was told that my husband was no more so he left us with the clothes and went back to tell his master the bad news. The master told him to come back and collect the money. Hey, which money? I lost it on him. I'm like, okay, fine, you are in luck. We've not buried him. He's still at the mortuary at St. Teresa. Go there, give him his clothes and collect your money. I just, oh man. It didn't make any sense. I couldn't understand. Someone died. Count your losses and move. Who is supposed to pay you? What was I even supposed to do with the clothes? How do you think? Adult. An adult. Hey, God.